The parent portal is a great tool that will save you time. Here's how to get set up. Go to the gear icon, settings, parent portal, and click the settings tab. You can customize what is shown in your portal on a large scale by clearing the checkbox for any of these settings. For example, the transactions checkbox allows the parent to view the transactions posted to their account. When parents enroll their students, make payments, etc. in the parent portal, you can receive email notifications by entering an email address here. If you need to give a message to your parents logging into the parent portal, you have the option of entering it here or on the News and Announcements tab. In the Family slash Student Information section, review each setting and decide what parents can update and what they may view regarding family information. User-defined fields are great for asking parents questions specific to your organization. You decide if they can be seen or edited in the portal. In the Fees and Payments section, you can choose not to display specific information in the parent portal, such as the transaction subtype, session, etc. Tuition fees can be set to post when students enroll in the parent portal. Use our Tuition Settings Wizard to get set up by going to the gear icon, Settings, General, Tuition Settings, or review your settings by going to the gear icon, Settings, Tuition and Discounting. Parents can have the option to make payments, and if tuition fees are set to post in the parent portal, payment can be required when a student is enrolled through the parent portal. Go to the gear icon, Setup, ePayment Wizard to get started. If ePayments are enabled in Jackrabbit, go to the gear icon, Settings, ePayments to manage payment settings for the parent portal. The settings in the Class Enrollment Settings section involve specific functionality of the portal. For example, prevent problem families from enrolling in classes or events by selecting the checkbox, or decide whether to show the number of enrollment openings. If you would like to accept donations on behalf of a charity, add the charity using the store feature, and then change the setting to Yes. A Give page will be added to the parent portal and immediate payment is required when a donation is made. Refer to our Help Center for more information.